So vector A is 4, 3, negative 2. And I'm going to dot that with my dot with my cross product, which is 1, negative 8, negative 10. And so for the dot product, 4 times 1 is 4. 3 times negative 8 is negative 24. And negative 2 times negative 10 is 20. So if we add 4 plus negative 24 plus 20, I'm going to get, I'll get 0. So that shows that A is perpendicular to A cross B. For um, the other one, since it said show it's perpendicular to both vectors, now I'll do vector B dotted with A cross B. So this will be, B was 2, negative 1, 1. I'll dot that with A cross B, which is 1, negative 8, negative 10. So this would be 2 times 1 is 2. Negative 8 or negative 1 times negative 8 is 8. 2 plus 8 plus negative 10. 1 times negative 10. And I'll get 0. So because I have gotten 0 with the dot product both times, I, I know it's, even one time it's perpendicular to that one vector, but um, um, let, me, let me write a little conclusion. On the math problems, um, Sometimes I'll write on the test papers, don't leave me hanging. Give me the conclusion. Like, since A dotted with A cross B equals zero, then we can say A and A cross B are orthogonal. And the same for B crossed with A cross B. I'll say similarly for B crossed, uh, nah, B dotted with A cross B. That, that dot product was zero, so they're orthogonal.